This year's Maneuver Warfighter Conference once again featured the nation's top defense contractors showcasing their latest products at the Maneuver Exposition. A glimpse into the future of the Army can be found each year at the Maneuver Expo, and it's the perfect opportunity for soldiers, senior leaders, and others to get an up-close look at the latest technologies, such as these smart targets. These autonomous robotic targets do not require operators. Instead, they are programmed with scenarios providing moving targets to soldiers. The torsos are built to take about 5,000 rounds and are able to differentiate between kill shots and body shots. We're trying to solve a problem here common to all militaries, which is the only time you do live fire training with realistic moving targets is during combat, is during firefights, which is a very bad place for on-the-job training. One asset of these robotic targets is that they allow decision making to be incorporated into live fire exercises rather than simply providing soldiers with a predictable series of stationary targets. It knows where it is and it knows where all the other robots are so it can move in a formation. If you shoot one robot, the rest can immediately run to the nearest cover or they can decide to attack you. We want to keep the shooters on their toes. The products on display at the Expo represent the technological evolution necessary to continually improve the lethality and safety of the American soldier. This Modular Protection Attachment System, or MPAS, is designed to work in conjunction with the standard issue helmets to increase soldier safety by improving how such things as eye protection, night vision goggles, and comms attach. The mandible face guard is the most distinctive feature. This has been a lot of result of feedback from the maxillofacial surgeons within the military, soldiers in the field having accidents that could have been avoided, especially facial accidents. Broken jaws, nose, teeth, those things on a turret or a gun can be avoided by having the right protection in front of your face. With the ever-increasing pace of technological evolution, the Army needs to keep developing new solutions for us to achieve overmatch in our future conflicts. David Wright, Fort Benning TV.